There is not one of us, August Caesar, that would not willingly make war upon Cleopatra. But how? Without also making war upon Mark Antony, loved by Rome and loving Rome. Loved by Rome and loving Rome. I have here the last will and testament of Antony, who so loves Rome. Read for yourselves how dearly Antony loves you, loves Rome, in this, his last will under his seal. Only lately brought from Egypt and deposited in our holy temple at Antony's request by the distinguished Sosogenes. Oh, an extraordinary mission for an extraordinary man. So wise, so close to Cleopatra, so trusted by her. Read in Antony's will, at the end, commit to memory the last request of your beloved Antony. It bears witness to his love for Rome. When he is dead, it says, when Mark Antony has died, it is his wish to be buried in his beloved Alexandria, in Egypt, among Egyptians, beside his Egyptian whore. Is what I say the truth? Do I speak the truth? Once more, the Romans warred upon each other, 